Aircraft enthusiasts step back in time at Coots Paddock on Albert Park near Serpentine. The day was organised in recognition of the 75th anniversary of the 1920 Derby Air Race, which raised funds for the war effort. Couldn't have expected anything better with all the effort and to see all these magnificent old aircraft here. It's absolutely great and to see the community support us, it's even better. A highlight of the day was a reenactment of the race involving six vintage Tiger Moth aircraft. The competitors took off at 30 second intervals for a race to Malmesbury and back. The Tiger Moth is a 1930s uh, design. Um, so probably the age of the aircraft here would be more um, 1940s onwards. While the pilots and navigators concentrated on the course, back at Serpentine, an aerobatics display by Bendigo's Martin Goebel entertained the crowd on the ground. The Pitt's special aerobatics display was just one of the many events organised as part of the reenactment celebrations. Despite taking off last, Bendigo pilot David Cordy and navigator Adele Patterson returned to Serpentine ahead of the field to win the race in one hour and 23 minutes. Uh, when we took off from here we kept basically uh, as low as we possibly could to keep out of the headwind until we got to Malmesbury and then got up a bit higher on the way back and it just seems we were able to sneak past where the other competitors were up higher and getting more of a headwind. Race organisers say following the success of the event they're already planning future races. Shelley Markham, Wind News.